So here we are. This must be the quarry right behind it. Let's go find some fossils. Bear with me for a second. First of all, everything's been sterilized, all the tools and stuff like that, okay? Okay. And uh, we're, what we're doing is we're, we're giving people a fresh crate of shale for 10 bucks an hour. You could just sit at a table, split it, and find the fossil. Okay. So here's a refresher of what you can find. Find fish, Ooh, bugs, cool. leaves. Very small, very delicate. Very cool. Um, so if that's something you think you might want to do, I'll fix it. Okay, yes. This one. This one. Oh my goodness. Look at all that. All right, and where would you like to sit? Nice shady spot. Not under the tree. This looks good. Okay, so you can just throw all your scraps in the wheelbarrow at the end there. Okay. And this is your keeper box, so everything you want to take home, put in here. This on the back, this is my card, and on the back it tells you how to stabilize and preserve your fossils. Fantastic. In case I get busy and don't get a chance to... Doesn't look like I'm gonna. <laughs> Anyway, so when you pull your stuff out, just be really careful because you know how it, as it dries, well, things appear and it naturally cracks. It'll even fall off of there. So you brush it off, make sure there isn't anything exposed, and then you always work your shell from the side. You don't want to scrape it, and you don't want to bang it, and you don't want to try and get every little layer. You want to go in the middle and pop that thing. And then, you know, you might get two or three splits out of one. You might only get one. Okay. This tool here can go right into the... I, mean, I think it's starting to be dry enough. See how that just melts right in there, basically? Mm -hmm. Turn it like a key. Work it around or turn it like a key. Split it apart. You want it to open like the page of a book. Okay. Great. So that's that one. The bigger, thicker pieces. You'll want to use two butter knives, you know, turn it sideways Okay. and, and do it that way. I don't want to work your shell because I'm real excited to see how this works. If it's not splitting good for you and you're seeing it's crumbling, mm -hmm. then, then we'll switch your tools around or something. But it's... Winter. We're going to pick up this one, this little guy right here. And we are going to find a woolly mammoth in this rock. Oh, it's all already coming to crop part. Look at that. Just broke this. Nothing there. Split it down even further. Maybe. not a fossil. <laughs> Looks like that might have been a stick at one time. Well, I'll tell you, using razor blades, this is, I bet they sell band-aids here for $10 each too. colors in there. Doesn't look like anything. Let's look. I don't know.
Here we go. Mm -hmm. Big reveal. Ooh, there we go. It's going. Cracking it like a book. And nothing. Not a thing. Getting this one is a nice big long split here. Trying to keep from breaking it. See it split all the way down to there. Loch Ness Monster. Here we go. We're going to break it. Looks like maybe a little bit of a leaf there. And that's it. No Loch Ness Monster. And split it the rest of the way. Still no Loch Ness Monster. See how that just split apart there. We cracked rocks for a couple hours and had a good time. We found a lot of leaves out there. This would be a good project for younger kids, but not too young because you are using butter knives and dulled razor blades. But we found some cool stuff. Check out the details on these leaves here and especially this one coming up. This one's about four or five inches long. Cool find. Uh, we did manage to find a couple bugs. This one here almost looks like a grasshopper or something like that. And this one here looks like a little bee, some sort of flying insect. And love the snail shell. Just check out the details on this baby. Great time for sure. Uh, it was a good time. Thank you for watching today. And be sure and give us a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button. Have a great day.